Okay, now let's talk about the role of the muscles. Let's talk about the trapezii and the serratus anterior. These are the ones that have been mentioned most recently in the literature. The upper trap was usually thought of as an upward rotator of the scapula, but due to its distal attachment to the distal clavicle, it produces elevation and retraction of the clavicle relative to the thorax. So in healthy people, the upper, the upper trap is only contributing to about three degrees of overall scapulothoracic upward rotation, while scapulothoracic upward rotation can average 50 degrees or more. Again, let's, let's touch on the lower trap and the serratus. The lower trap has that direct attachment to the scapula and has a line of pull to assist with that scapulothoracic upward rotation at the AC joint. The serratus anterior has the largest moment arm for producing upward rotation and can also contribute to posterior tilting. The middle and the lower trapezius generates that external rotation of the scapula at the AC joint. 